This is Alan Pierce reporting for technologytoday.us. I have here the Matrix drill system by Black & Decker. What we are out to do is see what this sucker can do. What I'm going to do is take this quick connect drill, one and three quarter inch hole saw, and drill as many holes as it'll drill on one full charge. So we should have some fun. I have over here the battery in the charger, and you notice we have a solid green light. That means it's fully charged. Solid green, fully charged. Blinking green, not fully charged. Red going down, and till it'll run until it stops drilling. A big thing about it is the actual tool itself does not have a light on it. That was one thing that was kind of a disappointment. You really don't know how good your battery is until you put it in its charging. Let's unlock the battery. Charge it down. Take our drill. And let us snap the battery into the drill. Okay, we are now ready to go. What's that is? You do some pilot. The other side. It's funny because the uh, battery is going strong, but I can feel the motor is getting hot. I don't know if Black & Decker figured that someone would be... ...putting it through this kind of test. Actually, I drilled more holes than I expected to, so I'm going to have to reset this up. I mean, the goal was to see how many we could do. I didn't expect that on one single charge we would go this far down. Now both the hole saw and the drill motor at this time are both rather hot. The one thing I would have liked to have seen on the battery is an actual light on the battery, not only on the charger. I have to be honest, doing a lot more holes than I expected I would be able to do. That drill tip, I don't have gloves down here, is just too hot right now to the cutter. 
the uh, circular saw to actually grab onto it to take it out. I can drop it out. Let's see if we can do that. Okay. Okay, it's out. It'll cool off. Let me go back to my pilot drill. just reached the point where this tool is actually stopping. And uh, I think I have just enough power to take this hole, possibly. Maybe not. Yep, we got it. And there is no light on the battery to show where it is. I'm going to replug it in a moment into the charger so you can see exactly where it's at. But let's see exactly what we did. We have three quarter inch and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight here. That's 16 holes. Now that's impressive. Now let's see where our battery is. Okay. And you can see we have a nice solid red flashing light. We performed the different jobs so, so far, which was the whole soaring loads of hole sewing of holes and starting with a full battery until the battery was actually down to it had to be charged. We were using the actual tool head, press the button to remove them, the actual tool head, tool head that comes with your initial purchase which gives you a drill and electric screwdriver. There are other tool heads out at this particular point in time and basically they all attach to the same base system, which gives you many multiple functions. Your finishing sander, your oscillating cutter, your impact driver. One of the things that you'll find rather impressive about the tool system is how much each of these parts weigh, that the gearing and the actual components are, are rather, appear to be well made. Um, what Black & Decker set out to do was by separating the two parts of the system was to keep the cost down of having a person be able to own a multiple, multiple tools. We want to thank you for your attention. Again, this is Alan Pierce from technologytoday.us reporting on the new Black & Decker Matrix Quick Connect tool system. Thank you.